Hey guys, Toy Bust here. Hope you guys are doing good because I am doing most excellent on this Sunday afternoon. Really relaxed, stayed home all day, had a couple of family members come over, we chilled, we hung out, we had some pizza, we bullshitted. But enough with that. We are here for my weekly hauls, my weekly mail calls, and something that I haven't shown on this show yet. I know I haven't. I even put it on my Instagram, I do not think. Uh, I've only put it on my TikTok, and it does have 86,000 views. My video, the one video that has, like, more than 100 views is that, and it's crazy. I will show that at the end of the show. But to get right into my mail calls of this week, I haven't even posted it on my Instagram. And I just don't know why. It just kept eluding me. Uh, I got this uh, from a buddy of mine. He was able to find it for me. Super excited. Uh... Down in Florida, really, really pumped. Was not able to find it. Still can't find it because I do want another one. But I haven't even done a reveal on Instagram. I usually do my reveals on Instagram first, and then I do it on this. So it's like a special. So let's check it out. Yeah. This foot soldier. Oh, man. Troubles of foot. Oh, this thing is freaking cool, man. Look at this. It's hard to see with the glare. Sorry about that. Or my face not focusing it. But yeah, man, this thing is freaking cool. The top hat, the different multiple heads, the foot soldier mar uh, marked at a different, I guess marking like what's a lieutenant or a captain or something like that. But really cool figure, really cool box. Loving the VHS NECA boxes. I mean, these things are really, really dope. I was just telling you guys on Instagram the other day, if you guys follow me on Instagram, about uh, Chrome Dome's box being similar to this. And then uh, who else's box? A uh, Metalhead box was similar to this. Love these uh, old school boxes. I even have a VHS tape. The FHE, just like that. And that's what it's referencing. And look how freaking cool that looks. Love it. Absolutely love it. Killing it with this. But yeah, this was my mail call from last week. Did not show it on Instagram. So you guys are the first. If you do not follow me on the gram, you guys should. We'll post somewhere around here my name for instagram so you guys can follow me and see this stuff before i put it on this show but got this guy troubles afoot really cool figure Demanding if i'm gonna open it, i have a bunch of foot soldiers opened right now so i may leave him in the box but moving on so went to gamestop the other day and my fiance just random we had to go pick up some pet supplies for our cats and gamestop right over there i'm gonna go into the gamestop if it's right over there so I went into the GameStop and as soon as I walked in, boom, handheld Tiger Hasbro uh, Power Rangers game. I thought this was going to be way harder to find. Found this only one, obviously picked it up. And then I have the uh, GameStop does like the $5 every month for everybody. And I had that. So the thing came up to 10 bucks. Can't pass this up. Super cool, man. I have the original. Uh, it's somewhere in there. I have the original. So when I was a kid, I had this. And now I have the newer one. So I'm really pumped. I'm leaving this 100% in the box. I love the artwork on it. Super old school artwork. Like the putties. It's really cool, man. The Rangers. Absolutely love this. But GameStop find. Super pumped about that. Moving right along to my finds. Now, I went to a local shop. I picked up a few things from him already. And he had a couple of pieces for me. That he didn't even know I needed, but he said he'd take a shot, and I needed it. So, if you know, you know what this piece is. And this is probably one of the biggest things besides the sign on the Ghostbusters firehouse that goes missing. I needed this to complete my Ghostbuster firehouse. He didn't know. So, they didn't know from uh, Third Eye Throwbacks. Check them out, guys. Really, really cool store. Really good guys. Love that store. Um, didn't know I needed it. Hit me up, and I was like, 100% need that. I need this because it completes it. So this is the um, the top piece to the um, Ghostbuster containment unit. So you put the ghosts in here, and then you attach it to this piece right here, and then this little lip right here, so that when you put it in, the Ghostbusters drop into the containment unit. I didn't have this, and now I have it. It's pieces massive. It's pretty big. With that piece on top, I can't wait to put it in my firehouse. I had it sitting here because I knew I wanted to do the video, and I just wanted to show it off. I mean, this thing is cool. I absolutely love that he had thought of me with this. Again, I appreciate it, dude. Uh, keep them coming. And you did. You hit me up about this, and this is the uh, handheld Ghostbusters. It was really a handheld video game weekend. 
and I got them both the same weekend. Really cool. Ghostbusters 2 handheld. Um, I don't even know the company. It's Columbia. Oh, Micro Games of America. Uh, this thing is awesome. It still works. The inside of it is really clean. The whole thing is clean. The, the screen's beautiful. The buttons aren't dirty. Really excited to get this. Uh, added right into my collection. Um, what else? What else? What else? Wow. I do have a lot. I do have a lot. Let me move some of this stuff today. So, posted another video on uh, TikTok. I've become quite a TikToker as of late. And I got this bad boy in. Look at that Hasbro. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. Let's get it out of this box. Oh, it's so, I'm so happy they did this. I definitely thought they were doing the Black Ranger next um, because they came out with the little helmet. So they came out with the Green Ranger, they had the Green Ranger helmet, the White Ranger, the White Ranger helmet, the Red Ranger, the Red Ranger helmet. So they had the Black Ranger mini helmet and I definitely thought that was going to be the next helmet. They threw me completely off when they did the Pink Ranger. But pink is one of my favorite colors. And this is awesome. The helmet is a little small. Um, I don't know if uh, Lightning Collection does that. Uh, Hasbro does that for the most part. but Because I have the Bandai one. And that, the Green Ranger helmet, fits perfect. The Red Ranger and the White Ranger ones, they fit. They're not that they don't fit. They're just a little snugger. But this is super snug. Like my whole jaw hangs out the bottom of it. And I did a TikTok video on this, so I will drop my TikTok also in this so you guys can give it more views. But yeah, I got this. This thing is super cool. I opened this bad boy up already. Uh, I believe I posted it on TikTok, not on my uh, Instagram. So this will go on Instagram tonight, maybe as I'm doing the video. And this will go up at the same exact time, but I am pumped for this. I got room. I'm probably going to move the White Ranger stuff down to the bottom shelf and put her to second because she is my second favorite right now. Red Ranger stuff always last because he sucks. But yeah, absolutely cool, guys. This is a really beautiful helmet. Um, really, really well made. Love it. Can't wait to get it out of the box finally and put it up here. I haven't taken I took it on, put it on, put it right back in, in here in the factory box because I mean, I'm definitely keeping the box. 100%. That box alone is beautiful. So. Um, that's everything that I got. So I got something oh, a few weeks ago that I said earlier in the video that I put it on TikTok and ended up getting 80, I think I'm up to like 86,000 views. And I've had a couple of videos on there and I mean, 100, 200, 400 at most. But this one, 86,000 views. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. So I'm going to show it to you guys. I haven't even posted on my Instagram yet, I don't think. I don't know. I don't know what I do anymore, but I have this, and my wife bought this for me, and I really, greatly appreciate it. It wasn't expecting it. I showed it to her. She loves sneakers, so for her to love sneakers and for me to ask for sneakers, she was she was more she was more to buy this than an actual toy because it's sneakers and she enjoys sneakers. But let me shut up and show this to you. So this is Reebok releases of the Island Iversons that I learned. I know nothing about sneakers, but a buddy of mine at my job was telling me that they're Ivan Ironson, whatever his name is. He's a basketball player, no disrespect, but these things are cool. You see the box, you buy all the shoes and they build the Megazord, so that's why it looks like the chest of the Megazord. This one has the sword, and then you undo it here to pop it out, and I'm pretty sure you fold it up and then like he's able to hold it a little bit better. But, look at these sneakers, guys. Look at these absolute monsters of sneakers. I have to thank my wife again for buying me these. These things are absolutely amazing. Look at these. I mean, they're gorgeous. I'm definitely wearing these once and once only. I'm going to wear these to uh, New Jersey Toy Con. And, oh, I might even wear them to Comic Con. I did get tickets to Comic Con, by the way. So... I would definitely wear these. Oh, the soles. They have like the Rangers on them saying stuff. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, yeah, there you go. You can see it's a little bit. But you know what I mean? Like, that's freaking. The detail in these are insane. And apparently, all the soles have like the Rangers saying stuff on them. It's crazy. Like, look at these things. Insane. Absolutely. They did so much detail with these things. Absolutely freaking love them. Look at the bottom. Reebok killed him. I rest, definitely want the rest of them. I, my psycho ass, want to uh, build the Megazord. So, 
We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. They do have a couple of them in stock. I know they're out of stock, but I just might buy like the women's ones, the kid ones, just the more or less to get the boxes to build it. So we'll see. I'm assuming they will come in like the same size standard box, whether they're kids or not, just because they have to build the Megazord. So, but we'll see. We'll see. But guys, that was my haul of the week. My haul from two, three weeks ago when these bad boys came out. Uh, my pickups, again, to Third Eye Throwbacks, much appreciated, keep them coming, and that was it, but if you guys could like, subscribe, share, and comment, it would be much appreciated, take it easy guys.